One Johnson County graduate brought his new high school diploma on a weekend road trip where it was a hit with a lot of rain and even some graffiti. But as WIMT's Buddy Forbes tells us, it's now proudly framed as a fond festival reminder. Not too many people, if anyone, can say they have their high school diploma signed by a famous person. <laughs> when Joel May packed his bags for a weekend music festival, he didn't realize his recently acquired high school diploma was joining him for the journey. It was with me and I just jokingly said, hey, what if I get my diploma signed by Chris Stapleton? He went to the same high school, might as well, right? So a plan was born to get the country music sensation signature. But much like the diploma, it would take a little work to get there. May wrote out a sign to hold up when Stapleton hit the stage Sunday. I tried to hold it up during the second song, and almost immediately somebody threw a beer at it, and it hit me in the head. So uh, I decided to put it right back down. <laughs> but he didn't give up. And with a break in the music, May saw his time to shine. He saw it pretty much immediately, well, not for 10 seconds, if that, and he, he said... Did you bring your diploma to a festival? <laughs> Hell yeah, I'll sign up, I'll pass it up here, man. And the certificate made its way to Stapleton. Oh, yeah. Okay, have it. <laughs> this certifies that I'm going to sign this right now. Where he etched out a signature for a fellow eagle. And I appreciate him, especially, and all that stuff, just because he's been and he's been an active part of this community and even this school specifically. And while this is not the first time Stapleton has played a part in May's accomplishment, sophomore year, we got we got we auditioned and we got picked to perform at Disney World, and we got to sing at Disney World and we got to do a bunch of Disney songs. It was really cool. He actually paid for everyone in that trip that year. The graduate says this was an unforgettable way to start the summer. I'm glad to see the way he's made it through everything, and I'm glad to see that he still cares about people that, uh, you know, that are from where he's from. In Johnson County, Buddy Forbes, WYMT Mountain News. May says his weekend at the Railbird Festival was a great time, and he's so happy to feel a connection with a country music icon who supports his home community.